guys, we're from Carnage. Uh, we're going to talk to you about 2020 Rubicon JL that we built for Jake, which is right there. So we finished this Jeep probably about a month ago. Uh, we delivered it to Jake at Orlando. So he never saw the Jeep until the day we gave you the Jeep. Right? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I ordered it from the dealership and then you went over. He bought it on Amazon.com, right selected Jeep JL, yeah. and then they just shipped it. It was prime and everything. <laughs> uh, so he, we picked it up for him and you know he pretty much picked everything he wanted. We didn't get to see anything until it was on the Jeep at his house, like a couple of weeks after, like almost four weeks after. It was more than six weeks. Uh, okay, so you've had the Jeep for a month. How long has it been? Yeah, I've had it for about a month. Um, it drives smooth. I mean, highway speed, the track straight, no issues, no vibrations. Um, everything handles really well. So, uh, so happy with Alex right now. The guys here did a great job. Oh, do you want to show? Yeah, I am. So I started off in the front, um, I got the Warren Neon winch, went back to 55, uh, ultra hook. Uh, this is a Motoville bumper, and the powder goes black. Um, on the side, these are the, uh, the Nemesis crawler players that I had uh, color match. Uh, for wheels and tires, they're 40 inch Mickey Thompson Baja Bosses with the uh, 17 inch KMC, what are these, the grenades? The grenades? Yeah, the, the new KMC grenade uh, that I had, powder coated orange. And then moving along, or I guess up front, I got the Baja Designs XL80s and the Amber. Going away, the uh, Motoville Rock Sliders. Again, powder coat of black. And then I got the, the door skins paint match to just kind of blend into the Jeep. So I got Fox 2.5 coilovers. They're 12 inch in the front, 14 inch in the rear, um, with the Fox hydraulic bump stops as well. Everything was, all the factory brackets were cut off, and the guys here at Carnage welded in uh, new shock towers and mounts for the, for the bumps. Um, it's a Rock Crawler Adventure Series long arm kit and uh, no limit sway bar links in the front. And then again, same thing, Nemesis Crawler player rear. Um, the only thing different here is actually I got the rear Curry Anti Rocks um, just for, for off road capability. For the rear, we, we use a tower from Rock Crawler, which we had to modify to work with the Fox uh, 2.5 coilover and the reservoirs. The reservoirs are tucked under the frame, under the top. Uh, so you can't see them, but they're hidden and they're out of the way from any rocks or anything that could damage them. And then the sway bar has to be modified to work between the tower and the bump stop. Because the bumps are front into the frame. So they, they, they go they're probably like a quarter inch from the sway bar. But everything clears a full flex, full stop, and full through. These are the Rubicons. They come with blockers from the factory. We added the yeah, yeah, details. And then I got the 10 pound power tank mounted up on the roll bar. And then these bags are from uh, XG Cargo. Those are just storage bags for the power tank accessories as well as any recovery accessories. Oh, this is cool. I didn't see that one. Yeah, I got that too. The trail gator from Outback Adventure Products. Nice. Make the margaritas. Yeah, exactly. All right. I was gonna, it was ready for Moab. Well, so that's the next thing we want to talk about. When we started this project, the main goal was to make it uh, EGS. And I mean, it was gonna happen. We were even talking about housing and trading, like turning the vehicles over there. But you know, it did happen. So we can't really go anywhere. We're gonna plan something soon. Where, do you, where, where would you like to go first? Uh, I know you had mentioned either you know, Tennessee or somewhere yeah. in Georgia. Uh, we, we talk about Windrock or River Rock or Coaches or AOP. Yeah. It's all pretty decent amount of driving for us. I mean, we're in Miami, we're like all the way down out of the United States, like way south. So not it's, as it's as a as hike. Not yeah. quite as far as Moab. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and then, I mean, hopefully next year we'll be at Moab for sure. Uh, I mean, we could go this year, but we the end of the year. Yeah. So, I mean, we, we definitely want to put some seat time on this Jeep and see what it's capable of doing. Alright, so this kind of concludes uh, the jail build for Jake. Thank you guys.